What's up my saucy people, today I have a quick little tutorial video on how to tie a bow tie. So although knowing how to tie a bow tie isn't like really an essential skill, I do believe that it is a useful skill just to kind of set yourself apart and you be more knowledgeable about you know how to be more presentable because normal ties are awesome but bow ties are twice as awesome. So without further ado, let me go ahead and uh, teach you guys step by step and as detailed and thoroughly as possible, I will teach you how to tie a bow tie. So first things first, if you don't know what an untied bow tie looks like, this is, this is what it looks like. And what you want to take a look at is here is you have some measurements and adjustments and then this little, this little hook piece. You want to adjust it to your neck size. Um, I'm at 14 and 3 fourths, that's what works for me. So you want to figure out what works for you guys and adjust it accordingly. And what you do, we can start. So we wanna go ahead and place the bow tie over our necks here. And the first thing to do would be, we wanna measure it out a little bit because we want one side slightly longer than the other. In this case, I'm gonna be using my left side for the longer side and my right side. This is gonna be a mirrored video, so just keep that in mind. So we wanna adjust that. Uh, what I like to do is just eyeball it. There's no strict measurement or anything like that. Just take uh, the side that will be shorter and kind of line it up with the middle um, or what would be the middle of the bow tie and this little crease indent here. Just kind of line it up right there. It gives you a pretty good measurement. So step number two, we want to go ahead and I'll bring it up close here. We want to cross it over. We want to take our longer side, in this case the left side, we we'll take our longer side and cross it over. So keep everything together. We want to keep it tight too. So just take the longer side, cross it over, pinch here, hold here. Step number three, we want to go ahead and thread it through. So under and over. And then whatever side that you started on, we want to kind of keep it there too. So this, I started on my left side with the left side being longer. I want to go ahead and just you know, throw it over your shoulder, let it chill there for a little bit. We want it out of the way for this next step here. So our next step is the fun step, where we actually get to create the shape of the bow. So what we want to do is go ahead and pinch right here, hold right here. We want to bring this up towards you so that you have the folded end on your right side. Again, it'll be different if you're using an opposite side. I want to go ahead and take it up and fold it and hold this bow shape form. You can see this right here, hold it and pinch it, keep it there, we want it there. And for our next step, this is gonna require you to switch hands often, so just keep that in mind. You're not gonna be able to keep the same hand positioning, it's just impossible. With that being said, the next step is to take the side that was just chilling, our longer side or our left side, we wanna bring it over. And once you do that, it looks sort of like an elephant, right? So I'm gonna keep everything uniform together. We have a little elephant going on. Now, this next step is the most crucial step. It's our final step and uh, it, could, it gets pretty tricky from here. So pay close attention, I'll go as slowly as possible. What we wanna do is go ahead and take the bow and bring it away from you. Take both ends, kind of pinch it here in the middle so that they're away from you. And here, here you can't really see, but you have to kind of feel around. There's a part where the knot and the bow separates and you can kind of create a hole. You want to create a hole here. And so once we have that, what we want to do, we're going to create our second part of the bow. Bring the bow in towards you or bring the uh, bring the fold in towards you so it's going towards your chest. And then we can create our second bow form. Now this this part of the bow doesn't have to be perfect. We're going to adjust that in the next part. Um, but you can see my thumb is kind of there. I placed it right here so that I know where the hole is. And we're gonna go ahead and feed part of the bow through the hole. Do it carefully. And once that's in there, we have it set. And you can bring the other piece around. Right now it kind of looks funky. You see kind of how it looks funky? We want to go ahead and clean that up. So taking the sides that are folded, this would be my top right, 
and my bottom left, those are the two sides that are folded, we want to pull. We want to pull it, makes it a little tighter, and from there, we can adjust how each end works. Just make it nice and pretty and clean. But it, we've kind of arrived at the last step, guys. Um, this, that's it, like once you clean yourself up, you have everything in place, everything looks good. Honestly, that was it. Uh, that last step is the hardest part. You just want to pull your collar down and show everyone what a great job you did untying your bow tie. So that is it guys, that is how to tie a bow tie. That last step was honestly the hardest step. I hope it was easy for you guys to follow. If you have any questions about the whole entire process, um, go ahead and leave them down below. I hope I was able to teach you guys something and you guys were able to learn from me. If you like this video, go ahead and share it with your friends because I know there are plenty of people out there who don't know how to tie bow ties. And again, it's not a necessary skill, but it's just something to have in your arsenal to say, hey, I can be fancy, I can tie my own bow tie, and I don't need to go to the store and buy a, uh, a clip-on. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you so much again for watching. I will catch you in the next video. Keep wearing bow ties, and keep it saucy. Peace.